my character's name is Peter Spencer. He and his wife, Nina, have um, uh, a husband and wife real estate company over the river real estate, and um, they are selling a house uh, on 44 Rayburn Drive. Um, and uh, this house has uh, s some pain inside of it. With the help of the genre, we were telling a story that just is not uh, being told in, in movies today. So it felt fresh. It's scary, and that's what you signed on for. You know what I'm saying? Like, what if you could get off the roller coaster at the top? Uh, or pause it for a second to gird yourself. Um, the fun is that it's going and going and going, and you know the crest is coming, and then after the crest, you're going to be screaming. And I think that's what the movie theater experience is. It's more for an adult audience. It's R-rated versus the previous grudge PG-13 rating. And it really pushes the audience. You've got to pay attention to what's happening. The grudge is based on a Japanese curse. And really, it's the belief that when someone dies in the grip of a terrible rage, they leave behind this energy, this darkness, or this grudge, this unanswered desire for vengeance and violence. And that's really the curse that our movie is based upon. The picture itself is put together like a marvelous, intricate puzzle for the audience to figure out. So it's really challenging for the audience in a way that the films that I started with were not. Sam had wanted to make an R-rated version of The Grudge for a long time, and this is its incarnation. So as an audience, you, in a sense, are learning about The Grudge through my character from beginning to end. Um, I, I play a character called Mul Muldoon. Uh, she's, a, she's a detective. She's a hardened detective. She's, she's a young woman, but has investigated homicide, she's seen a lot of stuff. She's gone through the, her own personal grief, a, a large uh, grief in her own life. Um, she has a kid. There's a lot of um, domesticity and sort of uh, mundaneness about the set when we sort of initially come to the movie, which is really interesting because I think it's, it makes everybody, it makes everybody feel like they could sit on that sofa, stand in that bedroom, be scared in that same hall. Um, there's something very gritty and real about the way that Nick's made the film that I think it's just going to be utterly terrifying. I think the reason why The Grudge will be so scary is because it is so rooted in family. Um, and, you know, it explores some of what I'd imagine are hu humans, certainly my darkest fears. Mm -hmm.